and welcome. Thank you for watching the Black Pearl channel. So today I'm going to share with you some very disturbing channel messages. This is not everybody's story. This is a very specific channel message. So please take it how it resonates. So the message that I'm getting is that there is a masculine energy that is HIV positive. And this person basically was on medication and they stopped taking their medication. Okay, so for some of you guys, if you aren't aware, there's a lot of treatment options for people that are affected with HIV. And there's medication that basically will allow you to become undetectable. So your viral loads will be very low from taking your medication. So if you were to go and get tested, you would come up negative. Now, if you stop taking your medicine, then you will then test positive and your viral loads will be high enough so that you can transfer that to another person. So I'm getting that there's a masculine energy who is HIV positive and this person has now stopped their medication. And by stopping their medication, they can potentially infect a divine feminine, okay? Um, for some of these guys, I feel like they lost their job or something, so they don't have any health insurance. Um, I'm picking up on this energy that whoever's masculine this is, this person could have had a good job or, you know, pr been pretty well off in the past. But now that they've lost their job, they no longer have access to this medication. Spirit just told me to tell you guys that this is a timeless reading, okay? Okay. So for some of you guys watching this, your person could have already had this in the past. For some of you guys, this person is going to catch this in the future and this is what's going to happen to them. For some of y'all, this is what's happening now. So take it how it resonates, regardless of whether or not this is your reading. What I want you guys to take from this reading, Divine Femmes and Divine Masculines, okay? Because sometimes I have people in my comments that say, no, the roles are reversed and they're a divine masculine and their divine feminine is now karmic, whatever. So take it how it resonates. What I want my collect collective to understand is that you need to be safe and just make sure you're having protected sex. Because I'm seeing a, a masculine energy that has stopped taking their medication and now is trying to come back around and can potentially infect um, a divine feminine. And I feel like whoever's person this is, they know for a fact that they're not on their medication anymore. So this is basically intentional, which is not cool. I'm also picking up another storyline. Spirit gave me another channel message that there's um, some karmic distorted masculines that basically are going to try to alter their STD tests. Like, this is such a specific, disturbing storyline, y'all. So, basically, it's a warning to not trust this karmic, distorted masculine. Warning, if this person comes back and tries to smile on your face, do not sleep with this person at all. And don't sleep with anybody unprotected because... Even if, let's say you do get, you go and get tested with your person or whatever, like th this is severe manipulation. This, this storyline is so twisted. It's like, I can't even make this type of stuff up. This is the message that spirit is giving me. So even if you go and get tested, it's like, you still can't trust that because I'm seeing there's somebody here that's altering an STD test. And there's somebody here that was HIV positive that stopped their medication. So if they if they were to go get tested, it would come up negative, but then they stopped taking a medicine. So now they have enough viral load to transfer the virus. Y'all, this is this is very scary. So the moral of the story is whether this is your person or not, pay attention to these readings, because this is the type of stuff that people do. And unfortunately, the only way to protect yourself is to either one, be celibate or two, just always use protection. Definitely go get tested and, you know, all of that. But you can't trust, you can't trust people. Like, people out here doing wicked things, very manipulative things. Like, who would think of something like this? You know what I'm saying? This is weird. I don't 
really, you know what? I don't know why this is popping up, but I, I ain't gonna get too deep into this. I see hot air balloon. Y'all know the y'all know the uh the balloon stuff been going around. I'm gonna leave that alone. I don't know why that's popping up in my reading. That's so random. Okay, thank you, spirit. So I know why that's pop popping up because I, I just heard surveillance. So this masculine. I'm not going to get into the political stuff just yet. I will later, but not, not today, y'all. So with the hot air balloon, what I'm getting is surveillance. So this masculine energy is, is watching. Yeah, and for some of y'all, this person is spiritually watching. Yeah, some of y'all, I just heard y'all say, like, I blocked this person. This person is still watching you from, like, a fake page. Um, and this person could be possibly remotely viewing you. This person could be popping up in your dreams. Yeah, the upside down. So I don't know if you where is that from? Stranger Things? I don't know if y'all know um, about the show Stranger Things, but the upside down, that's what that made me think of. So it's almost like from another dimension. This person could be in another dimension that's dark. And within this dark dimension, this person is spiritually watching you and spying on you. For some of y'all... Y'all might be feeling this presence around you. Like you might see little shadows or you might just feel like somebody's around. You might feel, you might be having creepy dreams. You might see this person in your dreams. For some of y'all, y'all might see flies or gnats. These are all signs of spiritual surveillance, okay? Take it how it resonates. Everybody's going to experience different things. But what I'm getting is that, yeah, thank you, Spirit. Y'all need to do um, a, 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 a multi-dimensional core cutting. Okay, this is real deep. Uh, I hope y'all following me. Most of my most of my soul tribe, y'all are very spiritual and and very open minded. So just just follow me here, okay? You need to do a multi dimensional core cutting because you may have done one on this plane, but this person is like stalking you from another dimension. So another, it's almost like they're. They, this is deep, y'all. What the. This person is stalking you and watching you from another parallel universe or from another dimension. Remember, this is a, the Twin Flame journey. I do Twin Flame readings on my channel. Not all my readings are Twin Flame readings, but most of them are. So you guys are deeply connected on multiple dimensions. So for some of you guys, especially if your Twin Flame has um, turned distorted and karmic, you have to cut ties with them on all dimensions all planes okay so you need to put that into your petition your prayer or whatever you're doing to to remove yourself from this person let's see yeah i see triangles so i'm seeing i'm being shown um this person could be not only stalking you from other dimensions but doing spiritual work on you yeah, and, and also, too, this person could have put you in a third-party situation, which is where they um, got these STDs. And I see Chariot. This is funny because the Chariot is actually a tarot card. This is not a tarot, a tarot card. This person could be coming in. Yeah, this person sees you as a jackpot. This person is rushing in towards you and sees you as a jackpot. But you got to be careful because I'm picking up on this energy of a masculine that is sick and that has stopped their medication uh, possibly due to lack of insurance or job loss all right what else spirit ping pong yeah this person could have been playing games with y'all and now this person has been left out in the cold five of pentacles yeah and now i see that this person is this is over curtain call and stop sign so this is a situation that you guys need to end and i see playing cards so this person is like getting readings on you guys possibly using cards themselves or um going to a spiritual person yeah we got we got joust this person is a clown yeah and i see um i see mosh pit like this person could just be in real dark energy i just heard this person is in a living hell all right, y'all, I'm going to have to wrap this reading up because my camera is dying. I need a new camera. Uh, 
anyways i'm gonna charge it and do some more reading so stay tuned thank you for watching the black pro channel and if you want a personal reading you can click the link in my description box and i'll talk to you later bye